Hi viewers and subscribers, my dear parents and my dear students. So today is the fourth session with our student. So if you talk about this academy, this is the only academy in India in which we used to train the students for cracking the neat and JE examination. So today is the session with Mudasar. He is a very good speaker. So his name is Mudasar. So now we are going to completely going to give a class based on neat and JE examination question. So myself, I am going to give it in a shortcut method. What about you, sir? I am going to solve it normally by using formula and concept method. It's a great thing. So he is going to take in a concept and formula method, and myself, I am going to take in a shortcut method. So let us go for the session with Buddha, sir. Let us go to the section. Now the question which I am going to read is repeated in NEET 2018, and then the question is when the light of frequency two new naught, when the new naught is threshold frequency, is incident on the metal plate, the maximum velocity of the electrons emitted is V1, when the frequency of the incident radiation is increased to pi new naught, the maximum velocity of the electrons emitted from the same plate is V2, and then the question is asked to find the ratio of V1 to V2 is, and then the options are 1 is to 2, B, 2 is to 1, C, 4 is to 1, D, 1 is to 4. Now let us go to the solution. According to the Einstein's photoelectric equation, the formula is E equals to W0 plus half mv square. Then note on this formula, then this formula also can be written as H nu equals to H nu0 plus half mv square. Then we substitute this 2 nu0 in the place of nu, we get H2 nu0 equals to H nu0 plus of m v1 square. When we transpose this h nu naught to LHS, we get h nu naught equals to of m v square. Let us say this equation 1. Simil similarly, when we are going to substitute h phi nu naught in the place of nu, we get h into phi nu naught that is equals to h nu naught plus of m v2 square. When we transpose this h nu naught to the LHS, we get 4h nu naught that equals to half mv2 square. When we divide equation 1 and 2, we get h nu naught and h nu naught get cancelled, then remaining is 1 by 4. That is equals to half m and half m get cancelled, then the remaining is v1 square by v2 square. When we transpose this square to LHS, we get root of 1 by 4 equals to v1 by v2. Then the v1 by v2 equals to 1 by 2. It is coming in the ratio of 1 is to 2, then the answer is a 1 is to 2. Yeah, thank you, Professor, for giving a wonderful session based on concept and formula method. Now it's the time for us to go into the shortcut method. To go into the shortcut method, to learn the magic trick, what you have to do is see the important number in which I have rounded here. So the number is 2. See, to go into the shortcut method, again I'll repeat, you have to see the first number, it is 2. What is the number before 2? Yes, you are right, it is 1. Write down that 1 here. Then, you just divide by, see the next number, what is the number 5? What is the number before 5? It is 4. So, I am going to write down this as 4 here. Take the root for this model, so you will get immediately 1 by 2. Now, you tell me what is the answer? It is just 1 is to 2. So, the answer comes in the option A, it is 1 is to 2. So, instead of going into some 8 or 9 steps and going into more than, taking more than 5 minutes, now we have solved within a single step and not taken more than 5 seconds. I hope you enjoyed this session very well. Uh, those who are coming very new to this uh, video, don't forget one thing. Yes, you are right. You have to subscribe my channel. The second important thing is you have to put the like symbol. That is very very important for the channel to develop. So those who are already subscribed, don't skip the video and please we see the video completely. The last one is share our entire education video to all of your friends. Thank you for giving this video and let us meet again for one more session. Bye bye.